Get ready for the 2024 Apple iPad Pro, a sneak peek into what's coming. Despite a quiet year for iPads in 2023, Apple is set to make a splash this year. Reports indicate that a new iPad, likely the iPad Pro, is slated for unveiling in just under five weeks. Let's delve into what we've uncovered. Hints about the new iPad are buried within the recently launched iOS 17.4 beta software for iPhones. According to tech news site 9to5Mac, the software alludes to an unseen iPad model. Get ready to be blown away. Dive into the world of cutting-edge technology as we unravel the upcoming 2024 Apple iPad Pro. This isn't just another tablet, it's a game changer. Stay tuned and be the first to know what's behind Apple's silence in 2023 and what they're bringing to the table this year. Don't miss out. The clue lies in the reference to a landscape-oriented Face ID camera along the tablet's longer edge. This is a departure from the norm since 2011, where every iPad, barring the 10th generation, has sported a camera on its shorter edge in portrait mode. The first ever iPad, launched in 2010, didn't even have a camera. Could this hint at a new entry-level iPad? While that would be exciting, it seems unlikely given that the entry-level iPad uses Touch ID, not Face ID, despite setup instructions for the latter. The evidence points towards a new iPad Pro, considering the iPad Air also uses Touch ID, unless Apple decides to upgrade one of these models to the pricier Face ID. This change would be a welcome one. The Magic Keyboard has already made landscape usage of the iPad more user-friendly, even with the current portrait-oriented Face ID camera. The code suggests, Face ID needs to be in landscape mode to identify you. This implies the camera would be positioned near the screen's top. The code further clarifies, Face ID works in both portrait and landscape orientations once setup is complete. For European Union customers, iOS 17.4 introduces several changes, including a new app marketplace alongside the App Store, in compliance with the EU's Digital Markets Act effective from March 7th. This suggests that the latest iPad Pro could hit the market in early March. While Apple could potentially delay this, and it wouldn't be the first time beta code has hinted at a later release date than the software's official launch, it's an encouraging sign that something- Thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video and want to stay updated with our latest content, don't forget to hit that subscribe button. Also, click on the bell icon to turn on notifications so you never miss an upload from us. Remember, your support helps us create more content for you. Until next time, take care and we'll see you in the next video.